killed everyone on the roster. And I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. The double champ does what the f he wants. Well, 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 the whole Xbox potentially going to PlayStation. These these rumors are just crazy, man. Now, before I get into the whole video, what is up, guys? It's your boy, Hercules. Now, okay, let's get into it. So, as you guys know, there's a bunch of Xbox fangirls out there that a lot of people listen to, which I don't understand why, but there is one specific one out there named Colt Eastwood who says he got a message from a viable source. That's probably the same source that told him the Xbox sales are incredible. But either way, that supposedly what you're hearing out there of these rumors are not true. Now, let's just go with his version. If this is not true, and that means everybody that has been reporting this specifically, not YouTubers, specifically, the big media, their sources are wrong then. And his source is 100% true. <laughs> right? You, the, you would think that, right? Well, see, that's the hilarious part because when if you go back to his previous videos and all that crap, you can see his viable source has never been correct. But, hey, that, that that's... If you listen to Colt Eastwood, you're the problem. You're, you're definitely the problem. Now, let's get into these rumors if it's true. The rumors are that Xbox is basically going to put everything on the PlayStation and Nintendo, which if you really think about it, this is their only viable source of income because they're not making money out of Game Pass. It's been proven whether you like it or not. You can go look it up. Do your fucking research. Be someone smart. Be active. Go look it up yourself. Now, what games could those be? Well, a lot of people are saying High Five Rush, Sea of Thieves, Starfield, Halo, Gears of War, Blade, which if you remember, they never came out and said Blade was exclusive to Xbox. Now, I think what's going to happen is these games will come now i could be wrong but i think they they will come but it'll be like playstation um how they have the whole pc model right how they'll have it for xbox exclusive for a couple months maybe six a year and then they'll start having them for ps5 and nintendo with wherever which ones work with i think that's what's gonna happen and at the end of the day, I mean, nobody wants to play Starfield. It was a flop of a game. Nobody wants to play Redfall. Nobody wants to play Halo. The only people that are playing those types of games are Xbox fans. And not even them can save their own company. Not even all the shilling they do for that company can save that company. So at the end of the day, Xbox, I think it's time for you to to hire someone that can help you. Fire Phil Spencer and bring in Jim Ryan. I think Jim Ryan could make Xbox profitable and at the end of the day, could actually make good games. But that is the video. Let me know what you guys think down below. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time. I just leveled up, I thank God.